It's called the Walmart Restorative Justice Initiative, and it's been existent in Arlington, Texas for the past 24 months. It's a collaboration between Walmart Corporation and the Arlington Police Department. And it was an eight-step program where we initiated to kind of harden the targets a little bit. And one of the steps was the restorative justice program where we provide second chances for first-time offenders in, in lieu of a, an arrest or criminal record. Some of the key elements that are needed to have a successful public and private partnership are definitely open minds. You want to have different groups that are willing to come together to step outside of what philosophy each entity may normally have as far as addressing uh, issues and addressing crime trends. So that worked for Arlington Police Department and Walmart Corporation. Something else that is definitely valuable and needed is the ability to come up with concepts that promote sustainability. It's one thing to begin an initiative, but it's another thing to have factors in place that don't require so much from either group to have to keep it uh, flowing. Um, another concept that is great is just to make sure that you have people on the team that are sincere and excited about pushing forth with the partnership and just making sure that you um, get your city involved, get the community involved, make sure that both corporations are clear and concise in the terms of the partnership and it should go very well.